Satan is trying to stop you but God will not let him there is something that the Lord is bringing to some of you and Satan has a plan to try to stop you but the Lord will not let him the Lord will not let him prevail this word is for a few people it literally just came to my spirit just now it's evening time where I am and I'm settling the kids in for there and it just came to me as a thought and I know the Lord is leading me right now because somebody needs this word Satan is trying to stop you but the Lord will not let him because there is something Father God is bringing to you and the devil knows that thing is coming to you because it's overdue and he's trying to do everything to stop you. The devil is trying to stop you in so many ways. There's some of you that Satan is trying to stop you by bringing an illness back to your body. There's some of you that Satan is trying to stop you by bringing distraction, by bringing loss, by bringing sin old scene that you have conquered and overcome already and it's trying to creep back into your life old addictions the devil is trying to stop you because he knows what the lord wants to do he knows that yes you are in christ so your destiny is definitely a glorious one and the lord is saying to you like he said to joshua be strong and courageous for I am with you do not be afraid the most important thing is for you to stand stand firm stand firm and keep your focus on the word and the Lord stand firm and keep your focus on the Lord and the word Satan is trying to stop some of you in this hour this is the end time it is critical right now you must remain align stay with the lord stand firm on his word amen god loves you so much child of god woman of god man of god that sickness that satan is trying to use to get you out the lord will consume that sickness because his word calls him our consuming fire in the name of Jesus Christ, the sickness that Satan is trying to use to stop some of you. Don't live a faithless life. Live a faith-filled life. Because you have won it all in Christ. Your faith is that victory that overcomes that sickness. Your faith in Christ is the victory. Once you choose to finally accept the fact that yes. I believe in Jesus, so I know I've got this. I know the sickness will not take me out because I believe in Jesus. That's where my healing is. That's where my deliverance and my breakthrough is. That's where my turnaround is. Devil, you have nothing on me. You may have tried to play me for a fool for a while, but listen, I have got this victory because the word of God says I've got it. How? Because I've got faith in Jesus. Satan is trying to stop you, but he cannot only if you let him stop you but once you have this revelation child of god the lord wants you to know this that he's with you he will not leave you alone he wants you to be strong he wants you to be courageous and stand firm upon his word he's with you all the way until the very end that's what his word is saying to somebody right now in this very moment god always has a plan whenever the, the enemy tries to come up and try to resist what god wants to do the lord always has a plan hallelujah the lord always has a plan in jesus mighty name and the plan of god will prevail over the plan of satan it will prevail god's plan must prevail christ has prevailed already forever O lord thy word is settled in earth and on heaven hallelujah this is god's word for you child of god listen and listen very very carefully because you're thinking that you've lost it but you haven't you have actually won it just keep declaring it that your victory is in christ your victory over the sickness you've got it you've got it you've got it you've got the victory over everything you've got the victory over the mental torments the pain torturing you whatever it is you've got the victory in your marriage you've got the victory you've got the victory child of god you do have that victory you do have that victory in jesus mighty name 
This is a miraculous hour for you, child of God. It's a supernatural hour for you, child of God. Don't turn to the left. Don't turn to the right. Just keep your focus ahead of you. Christ is ahead of you. Don't look backwards. Don't try to think how this is going to work out. No, trust in God and, and he will bring you out when you least expect it. Satan knew exactly that Jesus was going to be crowned king and be savior of multitudes. He tried to stop the Lord, but the Lord was focused on his assignment. The word of God did say that. The devil tried to stop Jesus when he propositioned Jesus. That he was going to give him everything that he needed. All of the kingdoms in the world. And Jesus was like, no, I'm okay. He kept his full course on his assignment. And, and he kept on moving. That's what the Lord is saying to some of you right now. Keep your full course in me. Keep your focus on what I've already revealed to you that I want to do in your life. The devil tried to stop Joseph when he tried to lay those claims upon him that he slept with Potiphar's wife. The devil tried to, try to stop Joseph by allowing his brothers in the first place to sell him to the Ishmaelites. The devil tried to stop, tried to stop Joseph. Yes, he did. Because he knew. He knew. There was light in Joseph. There was light in Christ. There's light in you too. And all the enemy wants is to try to stop that light from shining. But the devil is a liar. Let's pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray that this word has blessed your people. And I pray, O oh Lord, that yes, no matter what the plan of the devil is, Lord, you that are our, you are our consuming fire. Lord, I thank you that you have consumed the plans of Satan. Every plan of the devil against your children, it is consumed right now by the fire of the Holy Ghost in Jesus' name. I cover every, every single one of you with the blood of the Lamb of God in Jesus' mighty name. It is well with you in Jesus' mighty name. The Lord is with you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You have won it all in Jesus Christ's name. I pray for God's mercy over you. I pray for God's grace and God's covering, God's goodness, God's favor, God's blessings, God's healing power upon you, child of God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, it is well with you. The Lord is bringing something your way. I prophesy that over you. Father God is bringing something your way in Jesus' name. What you've been waiting for is finally coming to you in Jesus' name. The devil cannot and will not stop you. You will not die, but you shall live to declare the goodness of God in the land of the living. You shall fulfill your destiny in Jesus' mighty name. Receive grace even right now as I impart the grace of God upon you to obey the Lord Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. I love you all so much, but Jesus loves you much more than I can ever do. Do subscribe if you're here for the first time. And click on that bell to be notified whenever I upload or go live here on the ministry. I love you all so much. And I'll see you all very, very soon. Every link that you need will be in the bar below. Shalom.